the Cupertino picker. You will see that when you press on the button, you have a selection. You can select between 0, 1, or 2, and you will see the value on the screen change for the button. We will need to start with the int selected value equals 0. Then inside a center widget, we can create the Cupertino button dot filled. This one will have a child text value is equal to the selected value, which is currently the number 2. For the onPress function, we will use the show Cupertino model pop-up. Inside we have the context and we have the builder. The builder will have a sized box, the width will be double that infinity and the height 250. The child will be the Copertino picker. This one will have a background color white, the item extend 30. This is the height of the current item inside the list. The scroll controller will be a fixed extend scroll controller. We will also need children and unselected item changed. This will give us a new value. Okay, so now for the scroll controller inside this, we will create the initial item at zero. And you can see that every time we open this, this will show us the value one. Next inside the children, we'll have three different text widget, which will be zero, one, and two. And for the unselected item change, we will set state and say that the selected value is now equal to the new value. And just like this, you have created a Copertino picker with Flutter.